Hey guys, I ordered a strobe light for my weather radio. The smallest light I've ever seen. I was expecting it to be a little bit bigger, but it is so cute and small. I mean, this... I've seen them on YouTube every single time. Look how small this thing is. It's like super small. There's my hand. There's my hand. That's how small it is. Can we open it? Is it... Okay, let's go ahead and open it. Can we open it? Ah, we do. Okay. Base plate. That is the smallest light. I know. Oh, and I forgot to say, this is uh, SBC Rutherford. Sorry about that. I forgot to say that. Okay, what is the strobe light doing? What is this strobe light? There we go. Okay. All right. So this is one of the world's smallest lights I've ever seen. Do we open this? How do we open? This? Oh, we put the batteries in there. But how do we open? Okay. Where's the magnet? That to the side, you know. Okay, so I ordered this uh, eBay not so long ago. Let's see. Okay. Remove the red cover. Can be removed from either end. Okay. So. Ah, gotcha. Three LEDs. Those look like the LEDs I've seen on my train. Require two. Ready. This is probably the smallest unboxing I've ever done. That was that was quick. Okay. All right. So now I got it plugged up. Um, unravel this here. Probably one of the shortest unboxings. All right. Now. Let's test her out. Now, here's the thing my mom said. If it's too bright, I could not keep it. I could put it in my closet, but if it's not too bright, I could keep it. Okay, so. Plug this up, so give me one minute here. My camera holder right over here. Alright, so plug it up to external alert. Yep. This thing looks so much bigger on pictures, but I could be wrong. So, I mean, I was wrong. Right, let's see how bright it is. Holy crap, that is not bright. Oh wow, that's not even bright. But that is cool. Not bright, but cool. From what I'm looking at, that did not look bright whatsoever that did not look bright that was a minimum brightness that mm, no that is cool yeah i like this that is a very nice thing it's small it's small like i could put literally just hold this that is so cool well, that's has a little sticky thing on the back, so I gotta get them mount it right there. I'm gonna test it out since this unboxing was pretty short. Oh, you can unplug it, it still lights up. So, we're gonna test this out on many weather radios. So, we're gonna try to test it on the different antenna. It doesn't say it works with it, but we're gonna see if that's false. But let's go and try it since it has an external alert. Okay. Nope, doesn't work. Okay. Alright. Wait, I'm pretty sure the 519 has an external alert, so we'll give that a try. Yeah, wait, no, oh, that's it. That's, um, uh, pretty sure this is it. Yeah, this should be it. Let's try it with a radio shack. Maybe. I've never seen it plugged up to a radio shack. But we'll give her a shot. Nope, nothing. Nothing. Okay. Alright, so nothing with that one. Oh, sorry, the thing was upside down for a minute. Okay, so now I'm gonna try the alert works, which I don't know why it has a external alert when they don't even make strobe lights for these things. And yeah, they don't. So, we'll give her a shot. 
Just now remembered. Okay. Alright, we'll try this is the last one we will try it on. Alright, so I extend the cord. Where is it? There it is. Give her a little shot. Give her a test. Nope. That work. Does not work. Oh well. Alright, so it works on most Midland products and it works on the alert works. It does do it. It does work on that weather radio. And yes, it does. Um, that's weird, it does. It's not an alert works product, but that's still really cool. So, I'm going to decide where to put this. So,. This is a small light. I mean, that is super tiny. Super, super, super tiny. But, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.